A Spiritual Diary from Ukraine Spring 2022 April 16th Holy Saturday On Thursday we started the Easter Triduum. Thursday, Friday, Saturday are like one day that makes us partakers of the mystery of the Savior's love. Beginning with the Last Supper, where the Master washes the disciples' feet and gives himself first in the Eucharist and then on the cross. Holy Saturday is a day of special silence for me. Since April the 13th, when rocket attack on a Russian cruiser were reported, the number of attacks has increased every night. Although we got used to it, and it was a natural reaction of the enemy to the loss of the ship. A lot of information about the liberated Kiev region and the subsequent blockade of Mariupol and other cities leads me to silence. I especially like silence because it has different shades of sound. If you are experiencing the death of a loved one, then in the silence near her grave you remember all the warm moments of life together. You remember the smile and the love you felt. It is a silence in which there is sadness, love, memories and hope of resurrection. It is a silence that testifies to our human helplessness before death. But this silence also testifies to a temporary pause, for we are on our way to resurrection. There is a great lack of silence in our world and in everyday life. And this is so important because silence is a time of knowing God before which you kneel. It is a time of self-knowledge when the swarm of thoughts disappears and you enter into the truth about yourself. It is a manifestation of our helplessness before sin, which brings death and destruction. It is the hope of our great God who has conquered death. It is a love that has frozen, but it continues. It is a faith that needs to be tested. It is a grain that must die to germinate. Lord, let us discover the beauty and value of silence when we face death, yours and our neighbors. A spiritual diary from Ukraine, produced by Rita Radio, Norway.